Hey, kia ora everybody, Chris Fahey here. Hope you're going awesome. So look, we are talking real estate today. We are down on Carlton Gore Road in Newmarket, checking out the latest real estate action down here. Um, another beautiful day, so let's get into it. So Carlton Gore Road is actually quite a cool little location. Um, so you're obviously located right next to the domain and the amenity that that brings. Um, but on top of that, you've got a couple of pretty big anchors that help to sort of support the location. So you've got a big education presence through the university just next door and private schools. You've got big medical presence and I guess proximity to the hospital. And on top of that, you've got good public transport connectivity through the train and through the bus system, so quite a cool location. So at the moment there's what I'd argue two big projects happening on the road. Um, in addition to that it's peppered with a couple of others though. So first up we've got um, this project right here. So this is 77 Carlton Gore Road and this is being described as a refurbishment of an existing building. Um, but as you can see they've basically stripped it right back to the skeleton, so pretty big refurbishment. And this one's just going to remain low rise. Another example is the redevelopment of the former Fidelity Life Insurance Building into residential, obviously taking advantage of great location overlooking the park. Um, signage says construction starting early 2023, so I assume that that's paused at the moment. Um, but yeah, really cool location. So look, we'll head down to the other developments in a moment, but first, um, let's go grab a coffee. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Alright team, so the first of the big projects down here is this one just behind me, which is 105 Carlton Gore Road. And so this is a big project being undertaken by its owner Argosy to kind of modernise and update the building. Now you can see through here they've um, changed the colour of the building for starters. So they've changed it from um, matching the other white buildings down here to more of this like nice, what, what is it, like gunmetal? As part of the project, they're also doing quite a bit of environmental work on it to improve its environmental efficiency. And so it looks like this project's just about completed. Um, they've got the final landscaping underway as well. Um, question that I have is whether the other owners down here will do a similar thing and change the colour of their buildings as well. It does look pretty smart with that darker colour, although potential missed opportunity to create like a painted ladies type situation down the road with a bit of colour. Um, but I guess commercial real estate's maybe just a little bit too serious for that sort of thing. Alright team, so by far the biggest project down here is 110 Carlton Gore Road. So this is a brand new office building. Um, now this one's about 22,000 square metres, developed by Manson's, on sold to Stride. Tenants in there include Oricon, MetLife Care and Vector. I'm looking super smart. Really high sustainability ratings throughout this building. Green Star, Six Star and all the usual sort of stuff. Um, but yeah, it looks great. Obviously a little bit of a shame that they couldn't incorporate the um, Rugs Direct building into the scheme. Um, but I guess these things happen. But no, overall, great little addition to Carlton Gore Road. Right team, so that covers off the latest real estate activity down on Carlton Gore Road. While in the area though, figured I'd chuck in a quick bonus project. And that is the Foundation Village being developed on the Blind Foundation's land at the corner of Parnell Road and Monsell Road. So this is a very, very high-end retirement village being developed in stages. Uh, now one of the things that you can't really tell from the main road is just how well progressed this is. I guess because of the scaffold and scrim and that. But it's looking like it's nearly complete or at least well on the way at the moment. So look with that said, we'll wrap up this vlog here. Thanks very much for watching and we'll see you next time. Ciao.